Hello, welcome to my channel. My channel is all about soap making and home crafts. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos if you haven't already. You can also follow me on Instagram at thescraftworks for more sneak peeks and ongoing projects. The October challenge is slanted layers, and this is a rough diagram of what I have in mind. This challenge requires a good control of trace, so instead of using a stick blender, I will hand stir the lye solution and the oils together until it reaches an emulsion. I have also used the soap formula with 55% olive oil to control trays, to make sure I will have plenty of time to work with the soap. Once the soap has reached an emulsion, I have split my batch into three equal portions and further split up one portion in half. For the first and third layer, I will be colouring them green using spirulina dispersed in grapeseed oil adding a touch of activated charcoal in grapeseed oil to darken the green. For the layer in the middle, it will be a mixture of black and white, coloured with activated charcoal and kaolin clay. Adding an accelerating essential oil or fragrance oil blend to help the soap set quicker is also an important technique of this design. I'm using an essential oil blend of benzoin, ginger, and lemon. Stick blend the soap until light trays. Before pouring, the mold is set on slanted by putting another mold underneath. Pour the first layer into the mold. Clean up the sides of the mold by using a paper towel and set aside. Once the first layer has set up, stick blend the uncolored portion of the soap and add the essential oils. Repeat the same for the black soap. Once completed, flip the mold to the opposite side. Pour in the soap by alternating the black and white soap, pouring it over a spatula to break the fall and to prevent disturbances to the bottom layer. I think I've overblended the soap here, but we'll work through. Pouring the soap from the other side to make sure it covers the first layer. Smooth out the uneven layer using a spatula gently. Clean the sides of the mold using the spatula to keep the other layers clean. Again, set aside to let the layer to set. Pour the rest of the essential oil blend into the last layer. Stick blend well to fully incorporate. Again, pouring the rest of the soap using a spatula to break the fold. And then remove the mold underneath to set the mold upright, pouring the rest of the soap into the mold. Smooth the top using a spatula. then covered the soap and insulated with a towel. I unmolded the soap after one day and before I unmolded it, I placed it in the fridge to help it easier to unmold. I 
I really liked how the colours turned up for this soap, but the slanted layer didn't turn out that well. I should have blended the soap a bit more or maybe used a higher percentage of benzo and essential oil in my blend. I also should have just did an in the pot swell for the middle layer to make things easier for myself. What are your thoughts? Let me know in the comment section. And then I planed the soap to clean it up. Then I decided that these bars need some beveling as well. I would have preferred this soap to be my submission for this month's challenge, but the layers weren't straight enough, so I've submitted my second attempt. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.